how to turn your biggest obstacles and challenges into your biggest blessings and opportunities. It's Coop Blackson here, nationally best-selling author of You Are The One and The Magic of Surrender, live from Ghana, West Africa. As human beings, life is often not easy. We will all face difficulties and challenges in certain moments of our life. This is just part of the process and nature of what it is to be human. No human being makes it out of life without facing difficulty and challenges. In fact, anyone that did anything great, whether you're Mandela, 27 years in prison, Mother Teresa, Gandhi, Martin Luther King, Oprah, Elon Musk, they all face obstacles at some point. See, you can see obstacles as breakdown. You can see obstacles as a curse. You can see obstacles as something bad. But the real breakthrough and shift happens when you shift your perspective and don't see obstacles as something wrong, but actually see obstacles as a blessing, a gift, an opportunity. That's the first shift that we get to make if we want to transform obstacles. When we're constantly growing and evolving, we will often reach a point in our life, a limit of the old paradigm, the old way of being, where perhaps you have mastered, you've learned the lessons that you've needed to learn where you are at, with who you are in your current situation. In that moment, you will often face an obstacle, difficulty, challenge, crisis, or breakdown. Not as a punishment, not because you're doing something wrong, but in fact you have outgrown the old level of your life. The next level of your life will often require that you let go of what's no longer working. The next level of your life will require that you become the next version of yourself. So when you're faced with a challenge or obstacles, consider that the challenge and obstacle that you're currently facing, that you may not know how you're going to overcome. You may not know what you're going to do. You may not know how you're going to move through it or, or solve this problem, challenge, difficulty, crisis that you're in, is an opportunity and gift that your soul has drawn to you because you're ready for your next level. Obstacles are a sign. Difficulties can be a sign that you are ready for your next level. You're ready to graduate where you're at. You're ready to graduate where you're at so that you can integrate, put into practice everything you've learned up until now in this last phase of your life so that you can embody and move to that next level of life, abundance, joy, relationship. So... We often resist obstacles. Oh, why me? When you resist the obstacle, you're not able to fully extract the gift, the blessing, the learning that is a necessary initiation into your next level. So when an obstacle shows up, many times in the moment when a challenge, difficulty, obstacle, crisis, breakdown shows up, we're not able to see the beauty or the blessing in the moment. As you spiritually evolve, you move from asking yourself the question, why me and why is this happening to why is this happening and what is the learning? What is the lesson for why my soul has attracted this situation? Why your soul has attracted this relationship, this dynamic, this difficulty, this obstacle? You see, because the obstacle, the difficulty or challenge that you're currently facing will require that you tap into parts of yourself that have been dormant, suppressed, sleeping, disconnected, or you didn't even know were inside you. As a result, a good obstacle, a good challenge, a good difficulty, a good crisis will force you to tap into parts of yourself that were sleeping, that weren't activated, and as a result, make you step into more of your power, more of your potential, and live it. That is the blessing. So when you stop resisting the difficulty, when you stop resisting the situation, and you tap into the lesson, 
you're then able to tap into your own deeper potential. So that obstacle calls forth more of you so that you can become more of you to be able to then expand your consciousness so that as a result, because life doesn't just give you what you want, life gives you what you are. As you expand your consciousness, you become more, you're able to handle more, you're able to create more, you're able to manifest more. And as a result, you're able to attract more and life is then able to give you the next level of opportunity, relationship, platform, abundance. And that's the key. Stop resisting, learn the lesson, integrate it, and live in gratitude. Your blessings and your obstacles are a gift from the universe. You would not be attracting that situation if you weren't ready. The fact that you've attracted that situation, obstacle, difficulty is really a sign that you're ready. The universe must believe in you that you're ready to face this test. See, many times also, when you're ready to go to the next level, you will be faced with a test. A test in the form of maybe an X showing up. A test in the form of life falling apart and you have to put into practice everything you've learned. A test in the form of having to face a temptation. So that all parts of you can come into alignment. You cannot be the old version of yourself. You cannot manifest rather the new version of your life being the old version of you. So when you're faced with challenges, difficulties and obstacles, celebrate be in gratitude say thank you when you thank the obstacle while you're in it then you start accessing more of your power and potential and you grow so are you ready the obstacle is simply the consider it to be the weight the gymnasium to develop your mental emotional muscle to develop the soul force so that you can become the person who is capable of fulfilling your dream and vision. Often if you don't go through challenges, obstacles, difficulties and overcome them, you don't develop the mental, emotional, spiritual muscle to be able to authentically fulfill the vision, to run the race because you haven't gone through the fire. Bless the obstacle and trust that you are ready. You are ready. Folks, if you enjoyed this short video, share it with your friends. Check out my website, www.coopblackson.com. Make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel. Also check out my new book, The Magic of Surrender.